In this video, we're going to start using our course project to demonstrate how to do estimating on different items. We will start by looking at the foundations. To find the foundations, we'll first go to the index. So we click on uh, drawing two one index, and then we get here the index of uh, drawings, abbreviations, legends, general notes, and so on. So we're going to zoom into the uh, index of drawings, and in here we will look for the structural drawings where we will have the foundation drawings. So we uh, basically we want to look for drawing S1, which has the foundation plan. Go here to the uh, list of drawings, and then we'll just basically scroll down until we find S1, which is going to be the first uh, drawing for structural, and this has the foundation plans. So this is the, the first drawing in which we're going to do estimating. We uh, first check that the dimensions are correct. So this is a scale 1 8 to a foot, which matches our uh, scale 1 8, 1 8 to a foot in the on-screen takeoff. So we know that the scale is correct. We check the dimensions. We're going to check a vertical dimension and a horizontal dimension. So here is a, a horizontal dimension. We will use the dimension tool to make sure that this uh, drawing is actually the uh, size that it's supposed to be. So that was a, a horizontal dimension. Here is a vertical one. We can just uh, check those dimensions here. And uh, we now believe that, yes, indeed, the drawing is uh, to the scale shown um, in the uh, notes. So now uh, we're going to, to start by reading the uh, legend. So we see that there are to, uh, 10 by 10 existing concrete piles to be abandoned. They have these uh, sort of uh, markings on the drawing, uh, a small square, uh, white, with what seems to be a, a, a dotted line. Another one, uh, very similar but now shaded, is a 12 by 12 existing concrete pile to be abandoned. This one, uh, it's a, a concrete grade beam uh, noted as a GB1, uh, C scheme uh, beam schedule on sheet S6. So this we need to estimate. A uh, round 14 inch new diameter new concrete ogre cast pile C section 1 S4 and foundation node number 4. This sheet total number of piles 83. This one uh, it's a CMU wall uh, with reinforcement. This is a concrete wall with reinforcement and this is a concrete wall with reinforcement as well. These are concrete columns. Uh, we see the schedule on sheet S6. So let's start simple. Let's start with a count condition. We're going to count these 14 inch diameter new concrete auger cast piles. Okay, and they are identified in the drawing as circles with a, um, a, a, a lines that are not continuous but rather dashed. So we're going to create a new condition. This is going to be a count condition. Okay. The shape is going to be circle because this uh, auger cost uh, these auger cost piles are uh, 14 inch diameter they are round and we want our symbol to represent as closely as possible to the item that we are estimating. So the uh, width is uh, going to be 14 inches so we enter 14 in here okay and the name is going to be 14 inch cast pile. <coughs> now See that uh, the, the width has changed from the 14 that I entered to 1 feet 
two inches. This is the uh, typical uh, architectural notation, and that's what on-screen takeoff uses. But what may be even more interesting is uh, is that if we click on the width again, we the, we see the number 102. 102 is the notation that on-screen takeoff uses to display uh, distances, dimensions, and so on. And this notation has the last two numbers are going to be inches. And the first group of numbers will be feet. So in this case, what we see as 102 is interpreted by on-screen takeoff as one feet two inches okay so keep that in mind whenever you're entering with heights in these uh, windows so this is going to be a count condition 14 inch cast pile the width is uh, one feet two inches or 14 inches and we are going to click now apply and OK. So notice that our uh, mouse is now in estimating uh, mode. It's a cross arrows in the uh, mouse. But because I am, I, I need to zoom out, I am going to first uh, zoom to the entire page. And now I am going to just uh, zoom in a smaller section where I can start estimating the um, cast files. But now my uh, cursor is in zoom mode. I need to go back into estimating mode so I can click on the 14-inch uh, cast file condition and the mouse will get now into the estimating mode. So basically what I will do is just click on this uh, auger cost uh, um, symbols and start counting them. As I count them, I can see that the count on the uh, conditions window increases. I click and I click and I click and I keep counting the different uh, over cost that I have file and it says yeah the total number is 83 I counted 83 so I am quite happy with my counting of uh, cast files